Heartache in the high desert after the body of a 16-year-old boy is found in a dirt lot. Homicide investigators are now trying to identify the killer as the victim's family demands justice. NBC 4's Tony Shin live for us in Apple Valley, where Tony, you spoke with the victim's mother. Yeah, Carolyn, that's exactly right. As you can imagine, the victim's mother is absolutely devastated. This was her only son. Take a look behind me so I can show our viewers exactly where the boy's body was found in this dirt field. Investigators aren't saying how he was killed, but his mother says he was left here in a pool of blood. This is not fair. It is a pain that Elizabeth Schmidt can't describe with words, a deep heartache only felt by parents who have lost a child. My only boy, 16 years old, the oldest, and he's gone. She is standing in the exact spot where the body of her son, Robert, was found early Tuesday morning by a worker at a nearby playground. An amazing boy. <laughs> Lovey, caring. He was an angel in my eyes. He was everything. I don't, everything. Elizabeth says the last time she saw Robert was Monday evening around 7.30. Robert asked her to take him to Apple Valley Skate Park to hang out with friends. So she dropped him off. Everything was fine. Like He just seemed fine. And I said, okay. And then when we're on our way here, we were talking about dinner. When I got to the skate park, you know, he just, he just said, hey, mom, you got $10? I gave him, you know, I'm like, let me check my purse. I gave him $10. He had gotten off the car and I said, bye, I love you. And then he said, you know, I love you too. And then he knows I have work at 10. Elizabeth works from 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. So it wasn't until early Tuesday morning that she found out Robert hadn't come home. I, I had called 911. Um, you know, I pulled off to the side to call 911. Elizabeth says her son's friend, Dre, told her on the night Robert went missing, the two went to the Dollar General store on Navajo Road, which is just around the corner from the skate park. But Dre went home after another friend showed up. From that point, Elizabeth says it's unclear what happened to Robert and why he ended up dead in this dirt field across the road from the Dollar General. <laughs> oh, God. Oh my God. <laughs> Elizabeth doesn't understand why anyone would take the life of her son, but she does want that person to be punished to the fullest extent. Why would you just leave my son in the dirt? You know, <laughs> why? As you can see, there is a surveillance camera very close to the crime scene, but investigators aren't saying if it captured anything. Meantime, Elizabeth says Robert's friend Dre is fully cooperating with investigators. That's the latest from here. Reporting live in Apple Valley, I'm Tony Shin, NBC4 News.